how to use an index. What is an index? An index is your best friend for helping you quickly find what you're looking for within a book. It is an alphabetical listing of subjects found in an informational book, along with the page numbers on which those subjects can be found. An index is usually found at the end of the book. In the case of a multi-volume encyclopedia, it is usually contained in one or two separate volumes at the end of the set. So what are the entries you would look up? Names and nouns. Names will be listed, last name first, followed by the first name or initials. In this example, we will be using Camille Pissarro. This is a single book, so the index can be found at the back of the book. Let's say you have a research paper due on the DF series. As seen, the first time this topic is mentioned is in the book on page 260. Because it is an art book, the italicized page 258 means that the picture can be found on that page. Notice. Neo-Impressionism will also be critical to your research, as noted by the C also listed below your original topic. Find this term alphabetically in order to identify which pages in the book it is mentioned. These pages will be separated in different ways. 224-225 means pages 224 through 225 will be helpful. Commas are used to separate different pages. 8 comma 16 means that both pages 8 and 16 will be helpful, but not the pages in between. Let's flip to page 224 to see if we can find it. Do not worry if you cannot find a specific word in the index. This happens sometimes. This might actually be helpful to your research. If a book doesn't have the entry that you are looking for, there's a large chance that it's, the book has little information of, and would probably not be a good source for your paper. Now you have the skills that will translate to your future career, also known as the skills to pay the bills. Go on, impress your colleagues. If you have additional questions, please contact a librarian, either in person or online. Thanks for watching.